but in December is when we're gonna celebrate it. Oh, I'm so excited about Christmas because on your birthday, you get presents, right? Like, hopefully I'll get some presents today too. But when we celebrate Jesus' birthday in December, everybody gets presents. Oh my gosh, he loves us so much. And I love you so much. Okay, I'm gonna calm down now. <laughs> I'm so excited. So, this month, we're gonna talk about FAST. F-A-S-T. Because we're in the fourth quarter of the year already. And on New Year's Eve, Bishop gave us some points. And so for the fourth quarter, our points is that we're going to realize acceleration. Do you know what acceleration means? Who thinks they know what it means? Mm, not quite. Think about a car. Like when a car accelerates, and first it's going slow, right? And then it accelerates, and it goes It goes super fast. The same way my explorers do when they're in my classroom. <laughs> that is awesome. Okay, so we're gonna talk about fast. F-A-S-T. That's what we're gonna talk about for the next four weeks. So today, I'm gonna talk to you about faith. Hmm. What do you think faith is? Hmm. Have you ever heard the word faith before? I know you have. Because you go here at the Mount, the bestest church ever. So what does faith mean to you? I'm listening. Yeah, that's a great answer. What else? Is that Taylor out there? Hmm, that's a good answer. If you don't have an answer, that's okay too. Let's talk a little bit about what faith is. Faith is when we believe in something that we can't see, right? Now, I want you to, everybody stand up. Stand up, stand up, stand up, stand up. Close your eyes first. Now, sit down. Don't open them, sit down. Now, was your chair there? Was the floor still there? Of course it was, but you couldn't actually see it. And that's kind of how faith is. We can do something and believe in it even though we can't see it. In Hebrews, the 11th chapter, in the first verse, it says, faith shows the reality of what we hope for. It is the evidence of things we cannot see. Hmm. I want to talk to you about a mustard seed. Do you know what a mustard seed is? Do you know what color mustard is? It's kind of like my pants. Do you see that? Who likes mustard on their hot dogs? I do, I do, I do. Or maybe you like mustard on your corn dogs. I do too. Or maybe on your hamburger. That's me. All of that's me. But a mustard seed is so tiny, 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 tiny. It's like smaller than your fingernail. It's so tiny. And the Bible tells us that if we have a tiny, tiny, tiny bit of faith, then God is gonna be right there with us and he's gonna help us. Can you believe that? Do you believe in yourself? Do you believe in Jesus? I know I do because I can pray and I can have faith and I can believe that it's going to happen. Hmm. You might have to get a magnifying glass to look at a mustard seed, because it's super, super, super tiny. But God tells us, with faith the size of a mustard seed, you can move a mountain. Do you know how big a mountain is? It's like ginormous. It's like super duperly, super cataphragilistic, expialidociously big. <laughs> and a mustard seed, it's it. 
eensy weensy teensy teeny tiny itty bitty so tiny but with God you know what we can do all things yeah that means you and me and Bishop too so Matthew chapter 17 verse 20 here's what it says you don't have enough faith Jesus told them I tell you the truth, if you have faith, even as small as a mustard seed, you could say to this mountain, move, and it would move. And then nothing is impossible for you. But let me tell you what can be a mountain in your life. A mountain might be a big test that you have. A mountain in my life might be a big bill that I have. Mm. A mountain could be something that you're a little nervous about doing. You might be a little bit afraid, like maybe riding a big bike. You might be scared that you're gonna fall off, but you can have faith and pray and ask God to help you, and then you'll learn how to ride that bike. That's the amazing thing about God. So, whenever we have anything difficult in our life, we can use our faith to help us in that situation. A mustard seed might be really, really small, but it grows into a great big old bush. And your faith might start off really, really small, but the more you use it, it gets really big. And your trust in God will grow. Our faith gives us power to believe in the things that we didn't believe in before. So I want us to pray. So close your eyes and bow your heads with me really quickly. Dear God, may I always exercise my faith no matter what my natural eye can see because with you, all things are possible. In Jesus' name. Amen. Now, before I go, I want you to say, I will exercise my faith. Your turn. Good job. I will exercise my faith. All right, boys and girls, thank you for celebrating my birthday with me. And don't forget to exercise your faith this week. This is Miss Lynn, and I'll see you next time on Mountaineers Adventures. Bye-bye. Thank you.